Very crash landing shattering the quiet on a residential street in Georgia. A small plane spiraling out of control and slamming down into a yard and then erupting into flames, killing the pilot on board while a family escaped injury. Here's ABC's Ava Pilgrim. Tonight, this fiery plane crash under investigation. The house is on fire. A home engulfed in an inferno. Plane crash! No, there, a plane just crashed. The Atlanta suburb rocked by the explosion. We do have a pile of smoke in the air. A small Cessna plane slamming into the lawn of this home, killing the pilot. I looked back up and I saw the plane just spiraling out of control. And then it started taking a nosedive and spiraling down. This is a house fire resulted from an aircraft crash. Investigators say the plane took off from Cincinnati, and according to air traffic control audio from the cockpit, there was a problem with the autopilot. We'll definitely be looking at that and seeing if it was a factor. The family who lives here, thankfully not home, at church at the time of the crash, telling neighbors they were saved. By the grace of God, that's exactly how he put it. There were roughly 135 small plane crashes a year. That's about 10 a month, many due to losing control of the aircraft. Tonight, NTSB investigators pouring through the mangled wreckage of the crash site. That was ABC's David Pilgrim reporting. Now they've moved the plane tonight as they continue to pinpoint exactly what happened. Authorities saying they're researching both the plane and the pilot's flight histories.